events versus Christ. No events can touch Christ. However high the waves may rise, there is no drowning of his love and thoughts toward us. The test to, is to our faith. The question is, have we that faith which so realizes Christ's presence as to keep us as calm and composed in the rough sea as the smooth? It was not really a question of the rough or the smooth sea when Peter was sinking in the water, for he would have sunk without Christ in the smooth sea just as much as the rough. The fact was his eye was off Jesus and on the wave, and that made him sink. If we go on with Christ, we shall get into all kinds of difficulty, many a boisterous sea, but being one with him, his safety is ours. Our eyes should be off events, although they are ever so solemn, and surely they are so at this present time. But I know all is as settled and secure as if the world, whole world, were favorable. I quite dread the way many dear saints are looking at events and not looking at Christ and for Christ. The Lord himself is the security of his people. And let the world go on as it may. No events can touch Christ. We are safe on the sea if we only have if we if only we had the eye off the waves with our the heart con concentrated on Christ and on the interest of Christ then the devil himself cannot touch us for I am persuaded that neither death nor life nor any other creature things present nor things to come shall be able to separate us from the love of God which is in Christ Jesus our Lord Romans eight thirty eight and 39 it's moments with the book